So why don't you just tell people a little bit about your background, your ecology, like your belief system, where you come from? People want to know your story, Jerry. Uh, born in Louisiana. Um, the day I was born, uh, pretty much I had a bowel movement inside my mother. Uh, we were rushed to the ER. Grandmother was called, said, you know, come get your, come get your, you know, well, come check on your daughter, come check on your grandson. He's the one I'm going to make it through the night. You know, if the family wants to see these guys, you know, you kind of might want to come now because they're not going to live. Uh, they get to the hospital. My mom's having basically, um, a, a double blood, a, a double uh, blood fusion. She, she had one blood fusion that was unsuccessful, had another one. As she's doing that, they take me out of her, of course. Um, they're going to fly to me to New Orleans. All my vitals are dropping. Uh, so they tell my grandmother pretty much to say goodbye. You know what I mean? Like, you know, start picking off funeral stuff, all this. So she's like, well, you know, my grandson can't die because if he dies, my daughter's going to want to die. She said, you got to be a slug, You got to fight. Uh, pretty instantly, my vitals started going up. I didn't have to fly out to uh to New Orleans to to, to the intensive care unit and I was fine. Um that's kind of where it started for me. So the first name Slugger is not actually a boxing name. It's actually a family name that my, my family's called me since I was born. It just happens to go with Slugger. So um we proceeded um and pretty much uh you know regular life 12th grade pretty much it was uh gang violence. Uh kid was getting jumped in high school um, I pretty much broke it up. He was in eighth grade. We were in twelfth grade. Broke it up. Um, next day at school, one of the gang members tried to fight me. Happened to be the leader of the gang. Um, we fight at the school. I mean, it's like with that fight, it was twelve cop cars that had to come on my street pretty much to to break up. Like it was, we had five thousand kids in our school, so it was like maybe eight hundred kids on my street that day. It, it, was, it was it was ridiculous. So um, from there, we had a lot of fist fights. Um, like neighborhood fights, things of that nature. And from there, my dad was like, what I wanted to do in boxing, well, in life. Tell them boxing, you know, I always wanted to be like a boxer, a cop, uh, something with defending people or helping. So it is, you know, be a boxer. My dad comes in. He's like, hey, look, uh, I think I found you a gym. I'm like, what? Uh, we walk into the Moton, 21st and Jefferson, Newport News, Virginia, and uh, Bilal Abdul Muhammad. And that day, I never, I never left. Like I went in, never left in boxing ever since. Uh, states, nationals as an amateur, and now I'm more ranked as a as a pro. You know, um, it's 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 a blessing. It's a blessing.